people keep asking me how I get those lovely shaders working um, that they see in my screenshots. So I thought I would do a little demo video. Since that the shader packs are always beta or alpha <laughs> and don't work together, I usually trash my entire Minecraft folder, of course saving my um, save files. So I start from, from scratch. Um, first off, I, I download the game. Then I download the latest uh, Minecraft Forge, uh, the installer. Just grab the latest. Then I get the latest um, shader mod. Now I'll, I'll put all the links in the description. Uh, there it is. We start by launching Minecraft. Create a fresh world. Let's call this a shader world. Go creative so I can quickly go around. There. So that works. Let me go out of here. Then we run the, the forge installer. Install client. That will download any any extra libraries it needs, and insert them into your jar file, and creating a copy of the jar file so you can still go back to uh, to your plain vanilla jar file. There we go. It's been installed. So now, when I launch this, I should. I have two profiles. Play. There. So now we have an extra thing called mods. Now you see there's no there's no extra mod. That's because we haven't stuck it in the mod folder. So now I need my Minecraft folder, which is for me in libraries, application support, Minecraft. There we go. Mods. Um, so I want my shader mod in there. So now we need some shaders to go with the shader mod. Um, I prefer the Zeus one. Now, confusingly, they um, he lists several of them here, and uh, they don't work. Not on the Mac, anyways. Uh, all of them give errors. Um, so what I instead download is the legacy version. Um, you got the RC7 Ultra and the RC7 Ultra 1.6.2 compatible. I don't see any difference between them, um, so I'll just grab this one instead. Okay. Now they need to be inserted into um, the Minecraft folder, which on the Mac is in library, application support, Minecraft, shader packs. Um, if you don't have a shader pack folder, um, you have to just make one. Make sure it's all lowercase. And there's my shader pack. Right. Back to Minecraft, to our shader world. Then you do escape, shaders, and with a bit of luck, it works. And it does. There we go. So now we have the um, sunshine. We got shadows. We got wavy trees. Um, most important for me, anyways, is that water actually looks like water. There. Yeah. 
Now, this is the shader pack that he released to the public. And it's not my favorite one. Um, if you donate to, um, to Sonic Ether, you can get access to um, his development work. And I'll show you what that looks like. Um, library application support Minecraft so this is one of his development shaders I I think the water looks better in it but it's just my preference there it's also it's, it's also faster for some reason there um, the Zeus 10 release 7 seems to have um, tearing on, on, on the water where it doesn't match up. The frame rate is also much higher in this one. Um, let's check. Yeah, 15, 16 frames per second here, and everything is turned on. If I go to the, the public one that he has on, his, on, on the website. It's, it, it drops occasionally to 13, 11, 15. It's very random. And I just I just don't like the water. It's, it's too dark for me. That's it.